Bar Stool Sports. Bar Titus. Brandon Walker. Mostly Sports. All right. You want to wrap this up? I have hats. You no. want to pick a hat for shenanigans? No, we're not finished. We got to go till ten o'clock. No, I'm not trying to be done. I'm trying to wrap it. Up. I'm trying to what just kind of like. Up? I'm trying to just ease into the end. You know. Okay. I'm trying to like get get T a little. Hold on, TJ's got hats. I I got four hats from the party store. I wanted to see your thoughts on them. Okay, go ahead. So we want to explain what we're doing with these. Yeah. So TJ, when we were planning out ideas for the show, TJ just became obsessed with the idea of drawing stuff out of a hat. I think this is, what is this? Our version of the wheel yeah. kind of, it yeah. was just kind of like, we need a randomizer. Yeah. What, what is our randomizer? It I, randomizes I don't know, TJ, points and punishments and all this kind of stuff. Right. Yeah. These like, are the hats that he, we were, we were you just take a bag and I'll take a bag. We were brainstorming ideas. Brandon was like, I'm going to be a big dumb idiot. That's what I do best. And then TJ was like hats. And then we we're like, TJ, you keep saying hats. What do you mean? And he's like, I just want to draw stuff out of hats. Um, and, we're right. like, and we're like, well, let's see what it looks like. So, so we could do hats. like a hat for like places to go and film videos or a hat for video topics. Here's like, the first hat. Just your standard Indiana Jones type. Is that a fedora? Yes. Yeah. It's a fedora. But I don't know if this hat's big enough. Yeah, I don't know how many how many things you can put in things there. Things you can fit in there. Okay, well, yeah. that hat's on. There's this hat is big enough. That's my favorite one. <laughs> the top hat. Uh, it's going to be hard not to go with the top hat. That's uh, the the top hat. Although I, how many hats are in here, TJ? Four. Um, uh, you have a massive head. My head, my head's yeah, too big. <laughs> my head is size eight. I can't fit and and do anything. You're uh, size eight. Size eight, yeah. Where did, you went to Spirit Halloween? They still. Oh, I, I still. I guess the calendar turned back around. Now now it's almost it's Halloween. Right. I you was can't like, complain about I kept that. Thinking it was like May. Yeah, it makes. I'm like, how do they still? Have, <laughs> it makes oh, a lot of sense. I'm like, oh, all right. Well, I guess. I guess Halloween None stuff of these would hats be. Fit. There's that one. Hat. That <laughs> one. That one's great. <laughs> Uh, so what are we going to do? We're going to draw shit out of this hat doesn't go that deep though. If you look at it, it actually, it stops right here. It doesn't, it stops like right there. Oh, is that where it the doesn't rabbit go all is? The way. Yeah. So you have to like punch through okay. and grab the rabbit. If there, TJ, if there were a rabbit in there, that would be awesome. <laughs> a live rabbit yeah. that we just pulled out of this hat. You ever eat um, rabbit? I have actually. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. It's not good either. No. <laughs> Did you see that, uh, what the orangutan that threw a possum? <laughs> Did y'all see that? There's this video of this orangutan throwing a possum. This is silly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this is my tryout for silly this, season, this is, right? this is silly season. Yeah, so, so you saw it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I sent it uh, to TJ to uh, pull up. I think he's got it. Headline is orangutan ev evicts invading possum. Do, have you seen it? <laughs> Just, so, TJ, show me the – watch this. What is going watch on this. Right he's now? in his net. Look at this. There's a possum up there, and he's doing <laughs> it. He threw the shit out of it. The report said the possum was okay. It was seen. <laughs> Look at that. The possum is not okay, dude. He threw the fuck out of that possum. Oh my God. All right. Uh, do you want to try out some segments? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do uh, You want to go first or you want me to go first? Wacky Wednesday. <laughs> it's here. Here we go. Well, we're, we're trying to see what works. For, yeah, we are. Yeah. Let, let us know in the chat. Let it, however else uh, you so, communicate these days. I'll uh, go with my submission first. You go first. Because I think yours yours has the the sticking power, I think. Yeah. I think I think this one's going to stick around. So let's. This is my best idea. Let's start with the best. Let's put our best foot forward. All right. Here's my idea for a segment every Wednesday at 930. And frankly, it's just recognizing who has the power and the talent in my family. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the Tommy Walker Minute. I don't understand ghosts. I don't understand how they can take any form, how they can possess you, how they can just float around, or how they can distort reality to their will. What I don't understand most about ghosts is how they can take any form. They could be anywhere, anything. I've encountered some before. They just left me alone. Well, you've encountered some before? Where? You didn't hear about the watches? <laughs> That's a movie. That's not a movie. <laughs> All right. The watchers are a race of ghosts. A race of ghosts? Ghosts. Okay. They take the form of shadows. All right. And they end up just liking to scare people. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Tommy. Bye.
But <laughs> <laughs> so the idea behind the Tommy Walker minute is I'm just going to turn the camera on, say, Tommy, what are you thinking about today? I met Tommy for the first time uh, when I came to your house Labor Day uh, yeah. weekend. Yeah. And, uh, oh, my God, I, I couldn't get enough of it. You had thing. heard the stories. I had heard the stories, and I'd seen him, like, pop in on the yak every so often, but mm -hmm. I, I wasn't sure, like, how much you were coaching him. When You're like, all right, son, when you come on. How much am I coaching you're, him? You're coaching him none. 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 <laughs> The first, I think the first thing he said uh, when I met him was we were just sitting around as yeah. you uh, uh, by by your by your lake, and he just like runs up and he's like, "Here's what I don't understand. <laughs> how can he?" And he points to you. How can he drink sweet tea every single day and still be alive? <laughs> and then he just yeah. like ran away. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, that's what? one of his favorite bits. How can he still? How can he drink tea every day, sweet tea every day for forty years and still be alive? <laughs> And he says that, uh, whatever. But whatever. I ran into the conversation, said it, and then ran away. And I was like, <laughs> so is Tommy Walker a minute? That's a keeper, that's right? A yeah. That's a hit. Yeah. I think my favorite part about that video is at the end where it looks like he's going to be like the, the cartoon where it's like, got a blast. And then he goes, <laughs> yeah. like, like, he's about to spin <laughs> away into a spin <laughs> <cycle>. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He that's, starts, that's run, that's he that's starts running in place. place. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, we actually filmed two of those last night. The second one, quite problematic. <laughs> oh. So. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so. He had 9-11 thoughts? He got on his magazine. He's like, Dad, I, was, I did my own research uh, with 9-11. Um, here are my thoughts. No, it was about leprechauns. and <laughs> <laughs> he, he used alternate words for leprechauns. And it oh, got, no. It got oh, crazy. No. no, it was fine. Oh, no. I might use that one for next week. But that, um, So that's a keeper. We'll do Tommy Walker Minute every Wednesday. All right, now what's yours? Uh, this one is a little, uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't know how I feel about this one anymore. I'm getting I'm getting a little stage fright now that we're here. Uh, but I, I had an idea for a segment that's just called "What are the white women up to?" <laughs> <laughs> TJ, what are the white women up to? Uh, looks like this. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever heard of this? <laughs> What'd you try? <laughs> it's just bungee fitness. <laughs> I mean, sh <laughs> look at them. They are they are all white women. That's, uh, I, <laughs> that's all. That's, that's all. it. That's, that's all it was. That's what they're up to. That's all. It was. I uh, my my algorithm. You're gonna you're gonna say bonk and say I'm horny, whatever. Right. But uh, I I genuinely mean this. My algorithm is a a a bunch of white women stuff on Instagram because like I just get so fascinated with like the the white women that like just make the videos that are they're just kind of dancing in front of the camera and then they point and then yeah. like a graphic pops up and it's like when you take your four <laughs> kids to school right yeah, yeah, as a yeah, single yeah. mom. Yeah. And then you're like, <laughs> it's, yeah. and then you make spaghetti for dinner. Yeah. And, and, and I, I can't why get that, Why is that your algorithm? I, I don't know. I'm like so fucking fascinated with it. I'm so fascinated with it. Uh, all right. Anyway, I don't, was, I don't what, mind. What, what, what are the white women up to? I kind of like what are the white women what up, white to? Women up we, to? Let's give that another try next week. That, we'll try that next gets week. the second try. Pull up a uh, TJ. Can you get picture of TJ's here, by the, the way? The TJ. Oh, TJ. TJ's here, by the way. TJ, let's clap it up for TJ. Hey, guys. TJ right. made it today. You have 30 seconds, TJ. Explain. No excuse. No surrender. Show goes on. You can't see the light at the end of the tunnel without first entering the darkness. What's he talking about? We will get better. He's talking like a receiver right now. <laughs> <laughs> we will overcome. Kind of like Dion. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> what, what, huh. All right. Did TJ explain what happened? He didn't really. He just kind of. He yeah, just was, said a, a he overslept, right? What are we going to do yep. to punish him? We're going to come up with something. Um, I had two ideas. It's going to be extensive. I have two ideas. Number one, uh, because he we, we read his uh, academic paper about um, um, whether whether injuries should be shown on television. Right. Uh, I thought, what if we assign TJ a paper that we need we need sources cited um, on the importance of being on time, on or or like I on the, his, the history that. of alarm clocks. I want a five page paper on the history of alarm clocks. I don't mind that, but with sources. What if since he had the history of writing that paper about injuries. We assign him an injury, and he has to go out and get it. He has to go do the injury. Yeah, he has to go Kevin Ware himself. Go, uh, Nick Chubb. Yeah, he, do, he has do, to do go Nick Chubb injury. let a football player dive as fast as he can into that his knee. That feels fair. My other idea was uh, TJ, live on the air, pulls his pants down to his ankles and bends over, and we paddle him. But that, I, didn't know, I didn't know if that was too – Do we have a paddle? Is that, is that degrading, do you think? If, if who, he was who the, gives a fuck? If TJ was to expose his bare ass and we were to paddle him on 
live. I mean, I think we would bring in new audience. I'm not sure it's an audience we want <laughs> yeah, to keep. A lot of sickos. I also don't think that audience <laughs> is up at 9 a.m., but <laughs> we'll see. Uh, we got we got to do something. Maybe get the chat fired up over there, TJ, for ideas about your punishment. Somebody said blindfolded for a Rutgers game. That's not enough. That's not enough. Somebody said that's not. Enough. I think. I mean, you had an idea that you shared with me this morning. I yeah, think that's no, a good idea. I, the stream idea? Yeah. Where he's going to stream for an indeterminate amount of time, maybe five, six, seven hours, and he has to hit certain subscriber numbers yeah. to advance. Like, let's say we're at 13,000 subscribers right now. Yep. He he streams until we get 20,000. Yeah. like you, That might be you a have lot. To, but that might be a lot. but uh, 15,000 then. Yeah. Like, TJ has to, like, live stream from his place on the Mostly Sports channel. From... Two to, two to six a.m. Do a subathon, yeah, yeah. You have to. Do a we subathon. have to benefit from this somehow, correct? Because we 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 suffered yesterday. <laughs> the 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 technology wasn't great. Um, we barely know, got Tommy Walker minute in. We barely got Tom. Like you know, it, it, we as a show, we're trying to grow this thing. We just launched the show. We're trying to grow it. This this is a huge step back for us. When Tommy to found have, out that the Tommy Walker minute was twenty minutes late, I had to offer him another two and a half percent. Yeah, we sub. So I think T, I think that's a good call. TJ does like some sort of live stream. Um, to to get subscriber numbers. I don't want to overreact. Or we paddle him. One of the two. <laughs> I don't, don't want to overreact. But did you know TJ's the biggest fucking piece of shit here? <laughs> no, the worst the worst part about it, and I said this yesterday when we found out TJ was not in fact dead in a ditch somewhere, mm -hmm. um, is that if this was anybody else at this company, one, if they were late, we would have immediately been like this lazy piece of shit sleeping in. But yeah. with TJ, we were like something might have. He is happened dead. Yes. He's, yeah, he's dead. Uh, but two, because of that, TJ internally, it, the what he's feeling is worse than anything we could do to him, except bending him over the table and paddling his bare ass. That's why. <laughs> no, TJ, back to that. <laughs> TJ is uh, TJ's going through it. And I saw him going through it yesterday, and that's it's. I, I mean, I appreciate that about him. He's a hard worker, and he is on time, and he's very reliable. But uh, the bitch of it all is like. We are in a position where we want to make content out of this, but ultimately, like, it would be kind of cruel because we know that TJ is is already punishing himself enough. All right, I have a logist logistics question. That's hard to say. So I think we're both in the same place where ultimately we need to spank his bare ass, right? <laughs> we need to. <laughs> that, that, that's, I think we're all... I think we have to. We, we are, must. We're all on the same page here. To we, be clear, I don't want to do it. Right. I don't. That's but we to agree me, but that it's probably the right thing to it's do. It's the right thing to do. Spank it's, his bare ass. And with great power comes great responsibility. Well, and, my question from a logistics standpoint is, in this day and age where uh, it's kind of modern and it's kind of out of style to spank your children, yeah. are we able to buy the quality of paddle we were able to buy 25, 30 years ago? I don't great know question. if we can go out and get a great paddle. I think you got to go back to Mississippi, or i got to go back to Indiana. we got to go, go find an old the, school those paddle. Those are the last paddles. A vintage <laughs> paddle. The last. <laughs> <laughs> Some, there's a school in Mississippi that's still spanking kids. Oh, there has yes. To be. Yeah, m m a lot of them probably. <laughs> well, did you ever get spanked at school? Not at school, no. I got spanked at school many times. Yeah, I got spanked at home. I got spanked yeah. at school. Yeah. Seventh but, grade. Seventh, I got spanked in seventh fucking grade. I was 13 <laughs> years old. <laughs> Miss, Miss Isles spanked me. <laughs> I got spanked in college. <laughs> spanked the shit out of me. In, uh, I might have got spanked in eighth grade. <laughs> Which year? The first year or the second? No, that was 10th grade. You're thinking about. Uh, Are they doing this in front of the class? No, it's principal's office. Oh, okay. And they always would have to, the principal would have to go out of his office, go find another teacher or somebody to witness the, the spanking <laughs> So that they had on record that he didn't beat the shit out of him. <laughs> but the other, that was useless for me because the other teacher would be like just rooting for him to beat the shit out of him. Yeah. So they were just going to lie anyway. They should have had like another student witness and then as like a, I want you to see this and then right. go report back to the rest of the tell, student body. Tell, tell everybody else. What tell you them what you out. saw. <laughs> There's a reason I'm leaving you alive, you know. Uh, my, my parents spanked me. Uh, a few times when I was little, but then after that, it just became the threat, you know, like my yeah. dad would just be like, go, go get the yardstick. And then, I, and then like, it, it would kind of what we're doing with TJ where I would go get the yardstick yeah, and then I'd hand it to him. Well, and then he'd be like, I'm not going to do this, but you know, that dread that you felt as you mm -hmm. walked. Yeah. My and dad was a belt. Yeah. My dad oh. was a belt and I outsmarted him when I turned about 11 or 12, I, I used to collect baseball cards and I had the hard uh, case baseball, not the, not the, 
tiny sleeve, but the hard sleeve. Yeah. And I would stack like ten of them in my back pocket, <laughs> and he was just he was just beating the shit out of those baseball card sleeves. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Goddamn meth head. <laughs> and now he's dead. So who won that one, Dad? You piece of shit. Bang. Chalk it up for Brandon Walker. Dad's rotting in a hole somewhere, and my ass ain't hurting. So what else you want to talk about? <laughs> <laughs> so so what next? There was no way to segue that. There's no <laughs> so, way to move to another time. Speaking of ass kicking, uh, 49ers Giants tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Mostly Sports. I am Mark Titus. He is Brandon Walker. Today is Friday, September 22nd. And uh, what do you want to talk about, Brandon? Let me tell you, we're in Chicago. Yeah. Who is the most famous person from Chicago? Hmm. That's not Barack Obama. Hmm. Oprah? Oprah Winfrey. Yeah. Mark, look under your chair. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, kind of under your chair. That bag. You guys are all about tradition on the show. I'm bringing my own tradition to the show. Happy Friday, Mark. It's Henny what? Friday. <laughs> it's Henny Friday, boys. What's Somebody doing? put on some Bobby Valentino. Copyright free. Wee, wee, wee. <laughs> Thank you, boys. How about that? How about that? Happy Henny Friday. I need an excuse for a dozen loss after this, so I'm going to get wasted. Let's go. Boys. And yes, Cheers, I was brother. too afraid to go to the liquor store in Chicago, so I sent Ch Connor. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Nothing like a little henny at uh, 9 a.m. So it was it's a breakfast drink. Part of the, the henny was locked up. <gasps> that was all that was left. And I You bought this this morning? Yeah. <laughs> and henny was locked up? It was locked Free up. Free henny till it's backwards, But man. They, they said, they were like, what do you need? And I said, oh, I just need some Hennessy. And they said, oh, we'll get you some Hennessy. <laughs> <laughs> they knew. Dude, Don't you worry. You walking into the liquor corner store asking for Henny it has to be the... F they're still talking about yeah, it right yeah, they now. they were. They were. Hello, can I please have some Hennessy? <laughs> my impression of you is just kind of my voice. Somebody snapped a photo of me dizzy batting. And I'm... I'm you're a lanky guy. Um, I... I'm a... Br my proportions make no sense. You'll never see me in shorts. But I wore shorts to play dizzy bat and somebody snapped a photo of me doing dizzy bat. And my legs look thin. No! <laughs> this is a real picture? Yeah. My legs look pretty thin. Undeniably. TJ, is this a real picture? Yeah. This is not... That's unedited. Yes. And a Barstool fan decided to oh. quote tweet this. Oh, no. With a picture of him and his boy. Oh, no. Um, and it... Me, Nick Terrainy. And my son have the same size legs with the most unnecessary parentheses ever. Yeah, no shit. My son. <laughs> <laughs> and then somebody photoshopped the boy's legs over mine. And they're, uh, they're, they're larger. <laughs> somebody, somebody added rough and rowdy. <laughs> I don't know what so, to do, man. What, I'm wearing my thickest car hearts right now. What, <laughs> I don't want anybody to see a glimpse of land. What does your night look like as all this is going down? Are you rolling with the punches? Are you like, I got to put my phone down because they're fucking killing so me? So I think this guy had like 200 followers. I was like, nobody's going to see this. But then Will <laughs> Compton retweeted yeah. it. Oh no. oh, no. And so um, are you familiar with Reddit? I've heard of it, yes. So there's a very, uh, there's a barstool subreddit. There's uh, all kinds of different okay. subreddits. There's a subreddit dedicated to the d disease rickets. <laughs> oh my God. And you'll see that, uh, you know, there's been a takeover of the subreddit, and it's just photos of me. Jesus. So this is what I have to live with. There's the, there's the rickets subreddit. I have rickets. And, <laughs> and it just says, ouch. Ouch, ouch and dang. <laughs> uh, yeah. And so it's, it, that, this, I, there's me getting a base hit. Um, I had to wear leggings. Oh my god! Yeah, dude, me. Hold on. That one Hold I on. think is. Can I? Is. Can I ask the obvious? Um, about the Rickett subreddit. Why is the uh, <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> the 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 back the background picture? Uh, oh yeah. What so, uh is that uh? That's two skinny legs getting destroyed, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need some more Hennessy. <laughs> I need some more Hennessy. 
I yeah. either I either have had way too much Hennessy already or <laughs> not, not enough. enough. <laughs> I can't figure not out nearly enough. where I'm at at this point. <laughs> Do the uh, 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 Cracker Barrel. Let's get out of here. <laughs> we got to win the Cracker Barrel or get close. What, what's winning? Three? Yeah. One. Can I be totally honest? I've had no idea what we're doing with this thing the entire, <laughs> the entire show. I have no idea what the objective of this game is. Yeah, you eliminate till you get down to one. You got to okay. catch them all. And if you leave three or more or four or more, you're an idiot. Okay. I'll, yeah. I'll just watch and hopefully. Titus, it it's out. yours. Go. Because uh, you, you were all sassy over the last Yeah, time. you start on the right, obviously. Duh. Why, why does it doesn't matter if you left. start on the right or the left? Because like, if I have to explain that to you, we're never going to win. If I have to explain the difference between starting right and starting left. Um,. And then so last time we went middle. We crossed over the middle one. You don't want to do that. Or no, no, we didn't cross over no, the middle we one. No, we, we, we did bottom middle cross, and cro we crossed over from there. So do a different one. Cross over the middle one. Right. That's the one I... Yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. Go middle left. Middle left. What does middle left even mean? The, the, the one in the middle left. And then... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cross it over the right. Uh, now, here, here's where I think you... I, here's where I think if you go top down, that actually fucks you. And I don't think we should do that, you know? So you need that top guy for you leverage. Need, yeah, you need to keep that guy. Because if you go top down, then okay. you're going to have to okay. – then, so, then the next jump you go up, that guy's going to But that top's be. coming down eventually anyway. But if you go top think, down – if you go, I think if, you go up there, and then the top has options. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Go Go so up there. One? That's what I'm saying. This yeah. One? Yeah. Yeah, 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 do that one. Now he's got options. So when it comes down, it needs to mean something. But, okay, fellas? So this could go up – and then this could come that way, and then this could come that way. I like way, that. I like that. I like that. I like that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Now go top top down. Very top one. Or yeah, yeah. Either way. And then do, yeah. Let, top left one. Hold on. No, now you're about to fuck yourself. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. So let's think about this. comes down. Yeah, that one has to come down. It can't go up or he's going to get stuck. No, 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 no. If it goes one. up, he's going to get down, stuck. If it goes down, it creates a, it creates if a it hole. If it goes up, he's going to get stuck. Listen to me, God damn it. <laughs> If if you go if you go top left and jump the middle one, don't do it yet. Then the the bottom middle one can jump the other one, and then we have two right there, and then we'll that's setting up for the win. I think he's. But we don't have to do that yet. We don't have to do that yet. So, so make the make the call. Make the call. So we no, you, go, make the call. you make the call. I've been make. Go ahead. Go this, ahead. This one. All right. Go. This one. Is that the one? Uh. What 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 other options? No one else is throwing okay. out any all other right, options. Right. Go, go this go, way. Go, go bottom left up. God damn it! It's just so hard. What if we go bottom middle left top left down? What? You're just saying directions. Okay. Bottom so, bottom so, middle. So, so go time, go one right. one peg over to the left. Go left and then you take it and you. So then you take that one there, and then the one all the way top left, you jump down, and then you jump over the one you just jumped down. Oh, yeah. I think he's right. Say it again. Middle, middle to the corner. This one? Yeah. Do it. I think so. Middle to the corner. Okay. Now up there, top, down to him. This? Yeah. All right. Now he goes. Hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, 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 Second from the right goes up. Don't do anything yet. This goes up. If that were to go up, and then that, that one and then goes this over. This goes over. And then it goes and down. It goes down. And that one goes up. And I think we, we're getting close. I don't know. All right, try it. Scoop, what, what do you think? What do you think, Scoop? I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> Again, you could have said. But if we go, if we no, go, no, it could have said ball. If we go, it's not over. Hold on. It's not over. If yet. we go bottom left over. over to that one. Yeah, and then we do a double jump with the bottom left, basically, and bring down. it back down. Um, and then, this then that one goes over. over. No. Then the bottom, then the one in the bottom right corner is just hanging out there, and I think that one's the one that's gonna hurt us. Hold I on. think we might have to get bottom right corner out of the corner, and get it back. Yeah, so this so it has more there. options. Back in circulation. How are we get? We gotta get it in the how circulation. How we get it out there? Oh, we gotta we, we gotta get that one it, over. You can, you can jump, jump it over. You can jump it there. Yeah, and then like the no. Yeah, I think you're right. I think it needs to be in the in the party, or it's gonna get left. Yeah, that's I kind of like what Brandon was saying, but you just start playing everything back right once you. So so you, do you think funnel everything to the right corner? So once you go up and then you I take. Got it. I don't have it. Shout out to everyone listening on, right, the, pod, right. on the podcast. This is the, the worst way. podcast. Time out. Time out. Time out. The one on the bottom right goes to the middle. 
I think okay. we need to clear both the corners. And we're, then... We're going to have to shit or get off the pot at some point. Yeah, somebody make a decision. Titus, this is no, your No, this is your... Dude, you got us here. You just shut up. <laughs> this, is cl- this is the exact same thing. TJ, base. you're in charge. <laughs> go, TJ. We, we live with whatever you do here. Go. You dumb fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> Um, oh no! No, the bottom no right, you bottom can't right. go. Bo- if you go bottom no, no, right, no, no, if no you go jump. bottom second right, one, it's over. Second. God, you you have to go. So yeah, yeah. If you go here, <sighs> then you go here. We're That's out of fucked. moves. We're fucked. If we go here, we should have gone bottom right. I was right. We had to get the bottom right out of the corner. He's so stupid. You can't do it now, though. That's why. Lose. That's see. So if we do I this. wish you, I wish you had been dead that day, TJ. <laughs> So we're gonna have if you, three. If left. you make the last move, we lose. Yeah, we lose. We just lost. We just lost. Way to go, TJ. Does and that's how good? ball oh. is done, folks. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Go, wait, go left, go left, go left, go left. Go down. Whoa, go down. Whoa, go right. Whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> and that's how ball is done, folks. <laughs> that's how it's done. <laughs> Let's go. Yes. Dude. Holy shit! How'd that happen? Holy shit! I thought we were done. Evo. Never give up, dude. Never Holy back shit. down. Holy shit! Never surrender. Let's. <laughs> Holy go. shit! Oh my god! Frame oh. it, dude. Dude, and we we got it right in the fucking middle at the bottom. Joseph O'Hare oh. in the chat said, "LTJ, fuck you." <laughs> fuck. Where were you when that happened? God damn! Holy shit! Wait, but I'm confused. Oh. The X's showed up. I thought it was over. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Okay. <sighs> I feel alive. <laughs> All right, that's the show. <laughs> Suck my dick, Joe Namath. You could never do that. You could never. Do that. <laughs> we all come as that. We should see the. We should see. We should see the, the mouse. We should see the, the video phone. before we go. We haven't. We haven't watched it this week. Can we go ahead and see the? Dabo Let's just video. go ahead and see. We'll we'll end with the Dabo video. We should see it before we go. Do you kind of want to see? What, what else do you want to see? Kind of want to see the, Travis the, Kelsey, Kelsey video too. <laughs> Let's do the big three. Let's do the big three. <laughs> what's, the, what's, the, what's the big what's we got, the third we, one? Is, this is the big three show. What's I think the, it's the Duck the, losing its head. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Let's go Dabo, uh, Kelsey, Duck, duck losing, losing its head. head okay. And then we're done. And then right. that's the show. We got to see it one more time. I got to <laughs> hiccupy dickery done. The mouse, the mouse ran off the, the clock. clock. Coach swinging on the end. <laughs> I love pimping that one. Coach swinging on the end. And, and, and now he's on TikTok. Big three, TJ. We got it. We got the big three ready. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the clock. Coach Sweeney's got that drill. <laughs> and now he's on TikTok. Okay, watch it. Watch it again because I didn't notice this until now. Uh, he's got the pinkies out on the. Yeah, uh, Coach Sweeney got that. Why are his hands drip? The mouse ran up the clock. Watch his pinky. Coach watch his right Sweeney's pinky. Coach Sweeney's got that drip. Uh oh. <laughs> and now he's on TikTok. Why did he throw it up in the air there? Hit the whoa! It's a, it's a like a dance move on TikTok. Yeah. All right, there's you do it. You try it. You try to. I'm not it doing that at all. For Halloween, I will. Okay, I'll go full dabbo. Uh, video two, please. We should put that in the hat. We do we do uh, viral TikToks. Brandon has to do viral TikToks. <laughs> all right, ducks out here, Bryce. <laughs> <laughs> here it comes. There oh, it is. Oh fuck! <laughs> Motherfucker ran uh, pretty good too. Oh, oh, we've never seen this one, have we? <laughs> uh, Doesn't look as good from there because it looks like he's running slowly. He puts his head down in shame. That's so funny. And then, and then Boy, the, who's the, that re- <laughs> I love the rest of the crew running behind him. The Secret Service. <laughs> How is this video a minute long? What else is going on for the next 45 seconds? Well, we're gonna watch the whole thing. The fact oh, we're that- gonna watch the duck, the duck motorcycle guy come out. I should bring the super back back over here. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Somebody really like that. This is uh this is a very inexplicable tradition, if I'm being honest. Like why Yeah. This is a tradition. Yeah, they've been doing it. There's the smoke. I don't I just left a big line in the field. Destroy the turf. <laughs> That's very stupid. It's so stupid. And and why? Yeah. And why? All right. So Colorado's got a, a buffalo and Texas has a bull. What if we got a motorcycle? Yeah. 
Just, just, yeah, a yeah. motorcycle. That'd be That's sick. That's faster than both of those things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get out of here with uh, <laughs> Travis Kelsey. Please. I'm a little embarrassed to ask this question, but I'm going to ask it. Looks like my daughter is here, but okay. Is it a deal breaker if a girl, if a girl doesn't like to give oral sex? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's my favorite one. Oh, I love it so much. The fucking boy stepped out on the town. Yeah, you want, we, we should talk about the dinner. I mean, I knew we were going to at some point. I think the the time is here. Uh, yeah, yeah. We went out. We had a nice dinner. We. Uh, Do you really feel like it was necessary for you to go over the top of me and tip like that? I didn't want to make a thing. I tried. We agreed. I got ahead the, of it. I, last we, night. No, you got behind it. We agreed to the tip amount. Last night, I got ahead of it. I told everybody, do not bring this up. Uh, I didn't tip that much more than Brandon. It was not. It was It was a marginal amount more. We it was agreed not, to the amount before I wrote, wrote it down. I said, hey, you want to tip this amount? And you said, yeah, yeah, let's do that. I wrote it down. And then you handed me the pen, and I, I double-checked the math, and it was a little off. And I I had to bump it up a little bit. But I, I, but that's the thing. I didn't want to make it a thing. I, I, w I was prepared to not make it a thing. Okay, then, it's not a thing. Then. But then everybody's thing. just talking, like you know. And then I'm leaving the restaurant, and they're like, "Mr. Bear, Mr. Chicago Bear, <laughs> thank you so much uh, for your generous tip." Um, and I was like, you know, I'm, I'm doing my part, but uh, I don't just like, please don't, don't, don't alert the media. Don't tell the media. Um, but some somewhere along the How'd line, how the media get it? Then? Somewhere I don't know. The word got out that I tip more than you, and I just, I, it's, it's honestly kind of embarrassing. Like I didn't want it to be a thing, but. You brought it up now. Here all right. We are. I'm going to go around the room very quickly, and we're just all going to say the the piece of the, the main entree we had. I had the 22 ounce ribeye. Mark, what did you, you have? You ate a third of it. So let's. Uh, no, I had it for breakfast this morning. Okay. What did. Well, I had the 22 <laughs> ounce ribeye. What'd you have? I had a filet. TJ, what'd you have? Surf and turf. Ebo, what'd you have? Uh, contrary to what people are saying on Twitter, I did not have chicken. I had surf and turf. And then, which was a steak and lobster? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what did uh, what did Cody have? Anybody remember? He had a fillet yeah. well done. Yeah. Wow. A wow. well done fillet, yeah. That's pretty good. Well, that's not great. <sighs> Scoof, what'd you have? I had the uh, the dry aged Wagyu burger. And mm. it was lovely. One of the best burgers I ever had. <laughs> I don't understand what the problem <laughs> with this is. I mean you had we were at a fine steakhouse. Yeah. We also uh, we also all had wine. Except Scoof wanted a beer. Yeah, yeah, I got a beer. He's the blue collar man. Dude. Yeah, he's I like, am. I want a burger and a beer. I don't care how nice. Scoof the was just is. at a totally different restaurant than we were. <laughs> <He> was, <laughs> it was <laughs> fantastic. Cody, Cody I loved too. it. It was like very obvious that like they were like, "What is tartar?" Oh yeah, like, I, I asked. Dude, I had no I, idea what it oysters. Was. Yeah, it I was felt very like I felt like I was. It was like a boys and girls club situation, <laughs> and I was. I, I was like taking the inner city oh. youth out to, and I was like teaching you guys how to use your forks and like how to the wine list comes and the looks around the table from all of you were like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> and then I don't, I don't know. I, I know next to nothing about wine, but I obviously know more than everyone at the table. And then uh, I'm looking at bottles trying to figure out like what everybody likes. And I'm asking you guys what you like. And you're like, we don't even know. Um, so I was like, all right, well, I'm going to, I'm going to get a bottle of cab. And then Brandon goes, no, 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 that's not what we decided. I said, <laughs> I said, make sure, just let everybody That's order their own, I, let everybody order their own glass. That's what don't, I said. Don't yeah. buy a bottle. I was going to buy a bottle cab and Brandon goes, no, no, no. Just let everybody buy their own gas, glass because we don't know what everybody likes. Um, so I was like, yeah, great idea. Just let's just everybody get our own glass. I order the cab I wanted. Brandon immediately is like, just make it two of those. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so the guy's like, all right, two glasses of the cab. And then here comes TJ. And then TJ's like, yeah, I'll do one too. <laughs> and then Ebo's like, yeah, go ahead and put me down for one as well. Make it and easy. Then, and then the guy's like, you just want a bottle of that? And uh, uh, yeah, we, we get the bottle of cab. We get, yeah. what we get? Steak tartare and some oysters? Yeah. Yeah. And what, some pierogi, yeah. Little ca carpet baggers? Is that what they call them? I guess Put so. a little tartare on the oyster? <sighs> that tartare. Dude, we were... He, he did. He upselled us big time because he was like, it's the most bougie bite of food you can have. And like, we, well, we're going to go ahead and eat two of those. Then. And we had a magic show. Yeah, let's just uh, get to the point. We, the, the, <laughs> magic show, the magic show. Uh, I, I still I'm still trying to wrap my head around. Um, it was phenomenal. If you watch, so we, we can we can disclose where we went now. We went yeah. to Swift and Sons, uh, mm -hmm. which, by the way, when, when we talked about David Blaine on the show yesterday, that's why David Blaine was in my head is because yeah. I knew we were about to see a magic show that night. And I came up with a stupid excuse as to why David Blaine was in my head. Um, but, uh, yeah, the, on the menu was a table side magic show for $70, <laughs> yeah. which TJ pointed out immediately when we, when I made the reservation, TJ was like uh table side magic show. <laughs> yes, please. Um, we, we obviously got the table side magic show and it was worth, 
maybe 10 times that. Yeah. It was worth everything. It's fucking crazy, dude. If you watched O's the Mentalist on, on the Yak, it was very, very similar vibes to, to that. It wasn't like just card tricks. It was, I'm going to fuck with your head, and I'm going to tell you what you're, what, broke, what's in it, your phone. Yeah. Do we have the clip of Brandon uh, fucking up the magic? No, 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 no. That's not really necessary. Yeah. I, I mean, I forgot my... Forgot my phone passcode in the moment. <laughs> you put me under pressure. All right, I'm going to my calculator screen. Wait, why is the audio like that? <laughs> why is the audio like that? I might have accidentally fast forwarded in the moment. So we went from one in, one in six, one in three, to now one in a million. It's great. I like, I like how it's progressing. Please uh, place your phone below the table line and type in any six random digits, but not your passcode. Just six random numbers. I like the audio like this, actually. <laughs> and now slowly type in your passcode. Make sure you do the actual numbers and not the pattern. Brandon's gonna fuck this. He's gonna fuck this up. <laughs> <laughs> and hit equals. Help with your phone for just a moment, it's okay. I'm a magician. <laughs> that works every time, all the time. This big number here it means nothing because we have no idea what the first uh, six were, right? You right. can't like, divide it by two to get your code or anything. Sure. So when I sat over here, I watched your shoulder because when you hit plus, you're right there. And you move your hand around, your shoulder moves every single time. It's subtle, it's slight. So if I can try and backtrack, we're down in the corner. So 017071. <laughs> Here it comes. Here's the reveal. Wait. He's going to get it. Wait, he's not. Oh, the magician fucked up. Wow. Can I tell you something? What's that? I think I put it in wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I put it in 07. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's it. I don't remember. The magician's smarter than Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> the magician knows Brandon better than Brandon. I apologize for that. That's okay, but I got it right when you take it. I hadn't done the pattern. On the calculator. <laughs> <laughs> the magician knew your passcode to your phone, and you didn't. The calculator pattern is different than the the full phone pattern. So, I just, <laughs> and it was the pressure. I, I I flipped some numbers, and the the sad thing is, the passcode is Tommy Walker's birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I still got it wrong. <laughs> Oh, oh fuck. God. We got to do choices. What a night, man. It, it was, was a great night. It was a fun night. night. I great feel night. like. Uh, great night for the boys. I, I did tell Brandon afterwards. I was like, this might be soft, but that was genuinely one of the best dinners I ever had. And then that's, he called me a pussy, and then we went our separate ways. I did not. I'm, I'm kidding. Okay. Okay. This is the unedited picture that we. Uh, Mark edited the picture last night <laughs> to make us look all worse than <laughs> him. But uh, this is the unedited one. I asked TJ if maybe we could do some karaoke, but now YouTube is very strict on. Oh, really? Even karaoke yeah, songs. We're getting banged so, every time we do it. Damn. I could do a cappella. Hold me little, down. Little setup. I'm six feet from the edge. Can you do, can you do better than that? No, because I, I don't know the words. Maybe to that song. six feet. I'm not it's so fine now. Um, When I was in high school. Before I had the beard and everything, everybody told me <laughs> <laughs> this was pre. This was pre beard. To set oh, the stage. high school. PB. To set yeah. the stage, this was pre beard. I was picturing high school. You having a beard. <laughs> <laughs> People told me I looked like uh, Kenny from Where the Millers. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And so there was the scene in Where the Millers where he raps uh, "Don't Go Chasing Waterfalls" by TLC. Yeah. Rest in peace, Left Eye. Wait, what? She died on a missionary yeah. trip. Oh, I didn't know that. Mm. How'd she die again? A uh, van flipped. Oh, that's shit. what. Yeah, that's what yeah. I was gonna say. It was like a. Car Sorry to bring it down, I mean, man, but I just had to pay my respects. Would it be, is this shirt then insensitive because I'm wearing a, a TLC shirt? <laughs> no, I don't think so. That I brought. <laughs> Dude, I think I think your talent could be just I own a TLC shirt. Yeah. <laughs> my, my, talent, my talent is I bought this TLC shirt once upon a time. Well, no, no, no. So this was actually, this was in the pile, uh, Big Cat's pile. I don't know why, but it was in Big Cat's pile. And I was going to wrap the... Don't go chasing waterfalls if you guys wanted to. I believe that's Left I, Eye's part. Yeah. Is it? Mm -hmm. To be completely honest, uh, get the Game of Thrones thing all the way the fuck out of my face. I need. I need. Okay. Is rapping on a live show smart? <laughs> yeah, I, I checked the words. I checked the words. There were no bad lyrics. 
Uh, I had I had an idea for this show. Uh, maybe we'll do it one Henny Friday. <laughs> where we all, <laughs> on live television. Where we all play rap chicken. And, uh, <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> and the, the, the goal is to see see how what percentage of the song can you sing yeah. without <laughs> going over it's price is right rules yeah, yeah price is right <laughs> rules <laughs> oh i went over and, uh, like, now i'm so, fired <laughs> yeah, if you go over your career is done uh and and you'll you'll never be able to show your face in public again and if you, <laughs> but if you get really close and don't go over you it's win impressive, you yeah. win a prize <laughs> oh man all right so this is uh, Kenny from Where the Millers doing Don't Go Chasing Waterfalls. If you guys would join in. Do the it course. with the Henny in your hand. Okay. Yeah, that, that works. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, we'll do the chorus afterwards. All right. I seen a rainbow yesterday, but too many storms have come and gone, leaving a trace of not one God-given ray. Is it because my life is ten shades of gray? I pray all ten fade away, seldom praise him for the sunny days. And like his promise is true, only my faith can undo the many chances I blew to bring my life to a new, clear blue and unconditional skies have dried the tears from my eyes, no more lonely cries. My only bleeding hope is for the folk who can't cope with such an enduring pain that it keeps them in the pouring rain. Who's to blame for tooting cane into your own vein? What a shame, you shoot and aim for someone else's brain, you claim the insane and name this day and time for falling prey to crime i swear the system got you victim to your own mind dreams are hopeless aspirations and hopes are coming true <laughs> believe in yourself the rest is up to me and don't go chasing <laughs> waterfalls <laughs> just stick, stick to, to the, the rivers and the lakes that we used to i know that you're gonna have it your way or nothing at all but i think you're moving too fast there we oh, go oh man <laughs> That was incredible. All right, that was the talent show. Somebody will somebody will put in the, the music afterwards, and it'll you know. Holy shit! Connor Connor. Wins. My talent Connor is wins. I'm going to rap the verse from "Don't Go Making Phony Calls" by <laughs> Weird Al Yankovic. <laughs> <laughs> a bit safer. Um, TJ, do you have a talent? Should I go? You can go. I can go as well. If you you're go, just ready. go. Let's just go in order. Yeah. I was uh couldn't think of anything, and then uh TJ, when did I tweet this? July 29th, 2017. 2017 is when I discovered this talent. And this is the last time I was able to do it. And I had to capture it. It's one of my first ever tweets. Um, look at this. <laughs> Are you sass? All right. So uh, let's say I have a work meeting. Pop it right now. <laughs> but party time. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, what? huh? What? Pretty fucking cool, boys. <laughs> what? Yeah, pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Uh, what? Yeah. How did you discover this? Uh, I was fucking around, fu popping yeah. it up and down, yeah. dude. I was doing it for the rest of the day. <laughs> you know what? I think I found a feeling that's better than watching your team. <laughs> that's better than coochie. <laughs> celebrate <laughs> and or getting coochie. Popping a curl up and down, dude. Oh, man. Uh, my talent, I, I do impressions. Oh, no. I'm going to do some impressions. Uh, so with Nick on the show, I thought it'd be topical. I'm, I'm going to do an impression of both KB and Nick. This is uh, oh, this is my talent. This is all right. This is uh, my impression of KB being asked if he can squat 135 pounds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, that was just like him. <laughs> all right. This is my impression of Nick being asked if he can squat oh, 135 fuck. pounds. No. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's it. That's it. I'm Those pretty, are my impressions. I'm pretty sure I haven't promoted it. Pilar, my worst enemy, she's a, she's a, on the merch team. Just sent it to me last night on the Barstool store. I think if you search Nikki on the Barstool store, TJ, um, it, it, I, nobody's promoted it. N nobody will buy it. But do you see it? I'll buy it. No, but please way. don't. I'll buy that it. That first one? Oh no! Can we see the picture again no. for reference? No, we can't. Can we see the picture? <laughs> Horrible, dude. Oh <laughs> God! Who's gonna wear that? <laughs> oh my God! I've, I've been working on those impressions for months. Pretty good. Months. Pretty fucking good. No. That was awesome. That was, yeah, yeah that's bad for myself. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, TJ, what do you got? 
Um, I can wiggle my ears. What? <laughs> yeah, I guess TJ wins. <laughs> yeah, TJ wins. <laughs> In a landslide? That's pretty. Fu- that's impressive. Who was your favorite golden girl? By the way, I just got a note that you have to replace your boobs every 10 years. Really? Yeah. She, that I, have, means she's... I, have a, I have an industry insider watching. The, I swear <laughs> to God. I, have a, I, just got a, I just got a text from a, an, an, an industry insider. She's had... Who told me that you have to get them... You, you have to stop in for a tit stop every 10 years. That means Dolly Parton is now... 80? 77, I think is what it says. She's 77 yeah. years old. So now 70, a 75-year-old woman is stopping in getting her tits lifted. Yeah, every she's she's done it what so six times now five yeah, times six, six different times yeah six times. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come, come on, come on what Brandon? Oh. <laughs> come on what? <laughs> we should have <laughs> we should have never gave we should have never gave TJ this power. <laughs> Vaseline is a cheat code, though. Uh, it is a cheat code. It is that. a cheat code. We, who, <laughs> did, 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 Vaseline just means come. <laughs> so, so is that in the AI world, or is that like in the world in general? Like, is it? Are there people out there when you say Vaseline, they really read it as come? I I don't think so. I but maybe. Um, what a what, uh, no, never mind. I'm not gonna. And I'm you can't tell you can't tell the AI to uh, to do anything with come. No, right? You did it. You can't use, like, I can't even put, like, I tried to make a James Madison oh. thing last night, and it was blocked. What was the thing you did last night? Oh, yeah. You sent us pictures. Yeah, I just typed in all our names into the AI. and uh, I, Did you type in any other words? Because I feel like <laughs> no, some I of the. No, I just typed in Brandon Walker, Mississippi I feel State like fan. some of the images were misleading. No, uh, no. I typed in. Uh, I'm just not sure. Oh, me oh and yeah, let's player. go. I'm not sure me and Titus got the same treatment. That's all. That, that, Look no, at that, this guy. That looks pretty good, Mark. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, is that a is th- that was that was AI or is that yeah, a real that's picture? Just, that's just Mark Titus, basketball player. That's that's the f- and that's TJ. That's TJ, obviously. Uh huh. TJ, little Rutgers fan. All right. All right. So that there's, is there's a uh, Ebo being a nerd. Mm-hmm. Super nerd. Um. <laughs> this is outrageous. The, you can't you can't be. T- I just typed that. in Con- Penn State fan Colt for that one. That's yeah, all yeah. I was gonna say that's uh, Connor at the Colt at the Colt meeting uh-huh. for sure. Here's um, a little too red. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, how, 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 how'd we get here? Dude, I don't know. You got to work on like your SEO because that's what, that's what Can Bing we, thinks. That's what, you. that's what Bing gave that's, me. Yeah. Brandon Walker, Mississippi state. <laughs> I don't believe <laughs> TJ put Brandon Walker, Mississippi state into AI. And and t- it oh, here it is. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Ken Jack just saved that one and added Vaseline to the search. <laughs> As well. In eighth grade, I was in a band called 2,000 Miles to Darkness. <laughs> How many of those guys killed themselves? Just one. Okay. We were a duo. <laughs> <laughs> Sucked. Um, it's, it says here that Mr. Ed died in 1979. By the Shut way. Shut up, Evo. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Wait, does Mr. Ed have a tombstone? <laughs> Bamboo <laughs> harvester was. If so, let's spin the wheel. Somebody has to go gritty on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> no way. <laughs> That's a grave site? No. Threat's grave. Oh, wait, spin the wheel. Hey, spin the wheel. Spin the, spin the horse. No, we need a, hold so, on. We're sending one of us in this room. Stefan, you're in. One of us in this room. Somebody has to go gritty yeah. on Mr. Yeah. Ed. Yeah. Yeah. Go, go sing Ice Spice for, for Mr. Ed. How far is that? It's, not, it's Oklahoma. It's not that far. No, no dude. Do no, it. Dude. We have to do no. it by the end of 2024. No, has to. dude, I'm gritty on I'm the signing off. Dude, I'm signing off. I'm signing off. TJ, do a it's going to take me that long horse to learn. Race. Yes, race. give we us do, all we, a name. We don't do we don't do wheels. We got to do the horse <laughs> race. Do the horse race. Everybody in this room. <laughs> 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 I'm going to do a minute. Yeah, one minute a, horse race. One yes. minute horse race. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Holy shit! And this, this is going to suck. I really hope it's they have to go gritty. <laughs> I'm making Stefan go to Oklahoma. Please. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Steph- you're putting Stefan on the. Stefan ripped a pole of Henny. He of did. Stefan's in. Stefan's in, dude. Uh, Stefan, are you in or are you not in? If you're not in, get the fuck out of the room. I'm in. He's okay. in. He's in. Yeah. It's going to be you now, dude. 
It's a 10-hour drive, 10-hour, 20-minute drive. Oh, we got plenty of time to get there. <laughs> you got a gritty. <laughs> what are you doing this weekend? I got to go to Tallul- Tallulah, Oklahoma. <laughs> gritty. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, that's great. Sorry, babe. Can't. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if we tell them they're com- we're oh, coming yeah. and there's just people guarding it. Yeah, you're I can't not going to do seven this. people without paying. Hold on, I'll pay. The Westboro Baptist Church. Take me off. Just take take Stefan off then. You f- you're lucky this time, Stefan. Yes. Yeah. All right, here ready? Come on. Here we go. Here this we has go. a lot of. <laughs> <laughs> Never been to Oklahoma. This is the dumbest <laughs> shit in the world. <laughs> oh no. Winner goes right. Yeah. Yeah, of course. You of win. Course. <laughs> of course. Oh, hell yeah. I get to go Keep gritty up. on Mr. Ed's grave. <laughs> Brandon, I, you're too far back. It's making me nervous. Yeah, <laughs> no, yeah. I, winning right now is really good. If you were ahead right now, you'd I want great. the Couch Boys to go. It should be the one of the I Couch Boys. I hate my spot. I hate my one. spot. Dude. Fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> Connor, add commentary. Luckily, we have this song. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, Connor, commentate. All right. Connor takes the lead. Ebo trailing closely behind. We have a steady pack right behind them. They're tailing. 20 seconds left remaining in the race. Here comes Connor. He takes a small lead, but Ebo is falling behind. TJ in Uh-oh, the back Brandon. could be an upset right Uh-oh, here. Brandon. As we have Brandon oh, approaching the starting line. Get him, get Brandon get him, taking get him, a late get push. Him, get him, get him, get him, and and down the stretch. And here comes Brandon. It's neck and neck with Connor. Brandon. Oh, Ebo no. comes into the mix. No, 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 no. no, no. no. It's Brandon. It's Sinus. It's Sinus. Yeah! Hey! What a comeback! <laughs> what a comeback for Mark! Look at how happy his guy is, dude. He's clapping. Yes, yes. What? Dude, what was that? What was that? What a comeback! Oh, oh yes. Shit. <laughs> Titus, you've always wanted a gritty on Mr. Ed. Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> oh, that sucks so bad. You had to piss your pants last week. Now you got a gritty yeah, on Mr. Ed. What the Ed's fuck grave. is this company doing to me, dude? <laughs> what, uh, where's Mr. Ed's grave? Oklahoma. Where in Oklahoma? Why is it in Oklahoma? Is it by, like, anything relevant? Can I go see the Sooners play a basketball game? Yeah, go watch a Big 12 basketball game. And then go, uh. <sighs> can I go to, like. <laughs> you all right? Go, no. no. <laughs> the answer, no. <laughs> can I get, can I go watch Tulsa play basketball? Yeah, you could probably go to a game. Oral Roberts? Go to a mid-major game. Oh, my God, oh, dude. Fuck. I thought. That was awesome. That was, that was fucking awesome. I think I kind of I want to do that the rest of the show. <laughs> <laughs> Just bet on horrible things. Uh, we do have like a thousand spi- uh, spins. We have so many spins left. left yeah, spin, spin the horses while Connor's figuring out where Mr. Ed's. Uh, Just. Give me a town. I'll Google it myself. Talika, Oklahoma. Talika. Talika. I don't know how to say it. A H L E Q U A. Oh, it's barely in Oklahoma. C A H. It's on the screen. Okay. Oh, that's an easy drive. That's barely in Oklahoma. You're gonna need a producer. <laughs> it's a film. God, dude. It's uh, three hours away from the Sooners. Uh, Why, look, hold on. It's Why is halfway it there? between Fayetteville and Tulsa? Why is it there? TJ, can you that look at things question. to do there? That's probably where he died. Didn't Mr. Ed live most of his life in California? Yeah, right, but like fuck, dude? probably where he was probably a pasture. Northeastern State University. I'm going to a, I'm going to a basketball game in Northeastern State University. Um, also, Taliqua High School. We got to see how they're doing. Yeah, what's their team nickname? Are the boys bringing home state? Ho 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 ho! Stop right there. He has a grave, but he was Mr. Ed was cremated. So it's not even disrespectful to Gritty on it. Harvester actually died accidentally following a sh- shot of tranquilizer and was cremated. Wait, he was killed accidentally? Wait, Mr. Ed died of an OD. <laughs> Am I gonna- well, he was in Hollywood. <laughs> they buried him in an unmarked grave for 20 years, and then the Mr. Ed fan club of Oklahoma dedicated a standing granite gravestone to him. <laughs> <laughs> so he wasn't even... <laughs> Wait, the oh, might, hold he, on. He, hold wait. On. not even there you probably. The Mr. Ed gr- fan club of Oklahoma. Yes. Of there's Oklahoma. Oklahoma. there's state on. established Mr. Ed fan clubs. Hold on, jokes on all of you. Uh this is not that far from Fayetteville. I've never been to Bud Walton the There you go. Oh, I'm going to an Arkansas. Yeah, and, our, and the and the the hogs are going to be a top 10. Yeah, man, here, jokes so, on uh, us. <laughs> jokes jokes <laughs> on all of you. I feel <laughs> stupid. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Damn. Uh you know what I'm going to do for the room? You know what I'm going to do for the room? I'm going to I'm going to offer you the opportunity to redo the horse race to see if someone wants to take my spot because jokes on you I get to go to an Arkansas basketball game now. The vote has to be unanimous. Oh, yeah, you guys want to vote? Yeah, let's vote. Ebo. Yes or no? Yes. 
What? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. People got two votes. Final. Like a Democrat. <laughs> Let's go. I'll mail oh, one you, in later. TJ, I wouldn't laugh too hard because you have to come with me. Yeah, it sounds like I do. Yeah, you're gonna have to it certainly come with does. Me and uh, we should do it. Yeah, we'll 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 zoom into the show that day live from Mr. Ed's grave. Yeah, 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 dude. All right, Titus, I should, please I should, gritty. I should sit. I'm yeah. gonna sit cross-legged. I'm gonna sit cross-legged on Mr. Ed's grave the entire show, like a youth pastor. Yeah, like a youth pastor. I'm gonna or, slide into it like home plate. You need- <laughs> And we're gonna zoom in for the entire show. Wait, pour Grand a bottle of Henny on you it. Need to do a Wal- <laughs> you need to do a Walter Cronkite report from Mr. Ed's grave. Hey guys, I'm live here from Mr. Ed's tomb. <laughs> He's not below me. His corpse isn't below me. <laughs> we gotta find Mr. Ed. Welcome to Mostly Sports. I am Dabo Sweeney. He is Dabo Sweeney. Today is Tuesday, October 31st. We are live from Chicago. And what do you want to talk about, Dabo? Hickory dickory duck. The mouse ran up the clock. Coach Sweeney got that dream. And now he's on TikTok. (laughs) 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 Happy Dabo Weed. Oh, yes. Happy Dabo Weed. (laughs) What a day. What a day. What a uh, what a coincidence, I guess, or maybe it's not. I, I think he knew. I think he knew. Yeah, yeah. Last night, Dabo yeah. was on a rant. Uh, how long did, was that rant? Six minutes. Six minute rant. Six minute rant. Yeah. And how about the boys? Yeah. Too? Shout out to the Dabo Couch Boys. We got the L. Yeah. We got the L flag. The L flag is great. Shout out to Ebo. Yeah, uh, yeah. He's right beside you. You don't have to shout him out. Well, I'm just saying. You could just, just say, "Hey, good Ebo, job, great Ebo. job." Thank you, Connor. And we also got Dabo on the sticks. Dabo on the sticks. Dabo on the sticks back there. This, this makes my job considerably harder with gloves on. <laughs> <laughs> you wearing the gloves? Show what you know. Show what you know. <laughs> yeah. These, what What is it about? These are the most uncomfortable things these I've ever seen. suck, dude. But they are, uh, they are really Did easy. Did you put them to, together? I imagine they are easy to catch a football. They're very. Yeah, well, nothing's getting out of here, but I, they're stiff as a board. What, uh, what was with – Clemson wasn't the only school that did this, cause, but, but like – what what the fuck was that? That era? Are they still doing? Well, that? Yours looks good. That looks good. Yeah, but well, you got to put I, them all together like I that. I play ball, dude. So like I'm, you know. Let me see mine. I had a lot of. Well, okay, you didn't have gloves in basketball. <laughs> Mine's bigger. Mine's harder to put together. Why why was this a thing ever? Like, what was the point? Just that, like, but you remember this? Like, dudes would score touchdowns and they look in the camera and be like, "Yeah, but it was Ooh. for recruiting purposes." Like, right, I'm a, but I, yeah, I'm, I'm a, I'm a senior at uh, Spartanburg High School and I score a touchdown. Oh, there's a local news camera. Bang! That's who I. That's that's, that's where we're at with recruiting. Bang! When I was getting recruited, when I was going on all the visits, uh, here we go. You know, it, the <laughs> recruiting visits were just like fat titties and and a lot of drugs. There's still that fat was, titties and a lot of drugs. That was that was. But how there's you, also that's gloves. One over recruits, there's, not like gloves. Not like I got some really cool for you. If you make your hands in a triangle, it makes our logo. That's my that's favorite. Cool. Back in the day, ever. Back in my day, back they just gave day. us pussy and blow. <laughs> <laughs> that's how we got recruits. <laughs> but uh, Dabo is different. Um, so this Randy goes on. Dabo got that drip. Coach Sweeney got that drip. Are you going to sit here and tell me Coach Sweeney does not have that drip? Is anybody willing to go on record and say that? C- let's. You know what? Can we throw up a poll in the chat? Uh, Coach Sweeney got that drip. Right. Or? Now he's on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> so, Which one? When do you think of Coach Sweeney? Do you think of got that drip? Right. Or now, now he's on TikTok. TikTok. Which, which one comes to mind first? You know. We all look great, by the way. We all... I feel – clap it up for the boys. Clap it up for the boys. Uh, are we wearing the gloves the whole time? I don't know. I, <laughs> I, I, we, I was, we need to make that decision right now together. I would love to throw a ball around. I think we do. I brought a ball, and I didn't bring it in. It's in my It's in my Jeep. There's a ball in the in the pass-through seat floorboard give, of my Jeep. Give seven your keys. Yeah. Have go I don't lock ball. my door. Just be careful. It's snowing outside. <laughs> it, it was supposed to, though. <laughs> <laughs> it is snowing outside. It is. Halloween. Beautiful. Nice yeah. to have a white Halloween. I'm dreaming of a white Halloween. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> As the song goes. Ebo uh, and uh Ebo and Connor to look like a pledge class. Yeah. I don't think so. Connor looks like a graduate assistant. No, he's like one of the guys in the signals. There should be like a green version of him. Yeah. 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 Blue version. yeah, Dabo looks really good. Dabo more looks more like a uh uh just like a Clemson fan. No, 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 da- no. Dabo does look like a That's Ebo. No, Dabo looks more like a Clemson fan. Oh, but, but Dabo looks like right, okay, I got you. Dabo Yeah. 
I'm Dabo when it gets a little chilly outside. <laughs> and what what Dabo are you? Uh, I'm Dabo all the time on the street. What Dabo are you? I'm Co- Coach Sweeney got that dram. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm on TikTok. <laughs> I'm uh, Coach Sweeney. Coach Sweeney got that dram. I'm just going to say that as many the, times. What's the uh, search? Football is my game, but Jesus is my life. Um, it's, it's an important thing to remember. <laughs> because what's... here's the thing. Here's the thing. And in, in, in this era of college football, there's – there's a lot of talk about NIL, you know, a lot of these programs are out there talking NIL, but it's funny because here at Clemson, we, we've been doing the NIL. It's just been in Jesus's name, image, and likeness, you know? So for us, it ain't no different. Coach Sweeney got that drip. <laughs> <laughs> the timing of this man to go on this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, just throw in the middle. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that feels Dude, good. Yeah, now right? the gloves make sense, right? Let's just do this. I'll show. Dabo. 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 <laughs> Dabo. <laughs> no, this is. <laughs> this is content. Dabo. They just uh, produced the Irving Turtle. It's the Irvin Turtle. What does that mean? It's a turtle breed that Steve Irwin discovered years ago. They started their own turtle? And the first ever one that was bred in a biological or a zoological facility was just born. We should launch least. an animal. <laughs> let's launch an yeah. animal. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's um, figure out an animal. Yeah, dude. There's, it's, it, Has anybody thought of hedgehogs yet? Yeah, hedgehogs. Oh. Yeah, they're, they, they're around. You think we can start porcupines? We need a new platypus. Um, oh, that, it's been a long time platypus. since a new platypus dropped. Mm-hmm. Or a Brandon Walker capybara, like a capybara, but with your haircut. Yeah. Capybara. You know what that is? Capybara is my favorite animal. They're they're really fun. yeah. They're in Australia. Capybara. They fuck or around. South America. It's the same yeah. thing. World's biggest rodent. Yeah. You ever seen Big a, old rodents? A quokka? No, you made that up. No, it's a it's a smiling like thing in Australia that looks kind of like a capybara, but it's so happy. It's, it smiles. It's the happiest. Well, animal I gotta on the see planet. a quokka. I want to see a smiling capybara. Shout out to How do you say quokka? How do you spell quokka? I think it's Q U O. It might be two K's and then an A. Yeah, there it is. All right, let's see him. I don't see him smiling. What are, this is like a possum. No, the, the, this is the, like a possum and a koala bear. Well, I haven't seen like one a, smile. The pictures of them. If you look up an image. Yeah, they got a bad face. You promise? No, they smile. They smile. He promised me a smile. I've never seen a video of them. I just see still images of them. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's a better face. It's a cute little animal. I don't. Uh, I'm not qualifying Quoka, that as a smile, though. Quoka, why don't you? Uh, why don't you smile? You're pretty when you smile. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we, there's there's <laughs> there's Thor with him. Well, that's a duck face. Hey, I, that's hey, not really hey, a smile. Hey, smile, Quoka. That's a smile. There we go. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. All right. It's got a. It it has resting bitch face for sure, though. Yeah. When it smiles, it's it's pretty, but uh, it's well, got the I, resting bitch face. Not, what do you got to be sad about, Quoka? I think it's a happy animal. I th- there might I, I don't know. Capybara, let's, <laughs> let's go, capybara. I oh, God, I fucking love capybaras. Some of them get gigantic, which I like. Are we just looking at animals? Because I, I capybara with it's orange. A, it's got an orange on its head. <laughs> orange isn't supposed to be on its head. That's crazy. They're so funny. <laughs> around all the time. <sighs> somebody, somebody throw out another animal. I want another animal. Um, this is the best, dude. I could watch capybara videos all day. I, you know what? I'll just say it. Let's get. A, can we get a platypus video? Yeah. Let's check out platypus. Uh, otters. Platypi. Are, are, are we doing requests? Oh. I, otters are awesome. My favorite animal. Yeah, your you're an otter guy? Otter? Yes. I, I, I had an otter. They're the reason I go to the zoo. I had an otter at my... You go to a zoo for the fucking otters? <laughs> yes. Dude, otter... I'm, I'm with you, dude. Otters fucking rule. Otters are great. What do we got here? Oh, look, look here. There's a platypus. This is some yeah crazy shit. There's some alien shit right here. Perry the platypus may be a top five cartoon character of all time. Yeah. <laughs> like, what even is that? It's all of the animals. <laughs> that's that's an awesome animal. Platypus. Uh, what platy- are we doing otters now? Platypi uh, lay eggs, right? Yes. They're yeah. mammals that lay eggs, mm-hmm. and yeah. they are amphibian as like they can swim. They can. Sw- they can throw yeah. with both. both they, they wear a fedora, yeah. yeah. And they wear a fedora. Yeah. They wear fedoras. Yeah. Secret agent. Yeah. They live a double life. Well, what were you gonna say about otters though, Brandon? You were- oh, I, otters I, are great. I had an otter swim by my uh, my house yesterday. Really? really? Yeah. I think it's an otter. Might be a muskrat. Ooh, I uh, did muskrat. Uh, so, so that, no. that I didn't. I 
I meant to Google the difference between otters and muskrats yesterday. Yeah. So I could tell. Oh. Muskrats are great. Tell me, Connor, tell me the difference between otters and muskrats. I'll look it up. Um, by oh. the way, when you search world's happiest animal, Quoco is the first thing that pops Look at, look at the, the otters are great. You're, you guys are right. Otters are fantastic. No, otters are great zoo animals because they're always active, too. Like, some of the animals you go to, like, lion, like lions. Lions don't do shit. Lions kind of don't do shit. They're, yeah. they're fun to watch when they're doing shit, but they kind of don't do shit. Otters, 100% hit rate. You go see otter at a zoo. It's going to be doing some shit. Otters and the climbing monkeys. The climbing monkeys, yeah. Yeah. Now, Mark, that was a sea otter. Personally, I prefer river otters. Okay. But. I, uh, okay. I, well, why do you prefer river I don't. Otters? I don't discriminate. <laughs> I don't know. River otters. All otters matter to me. Uh, I'm just going to stop talking because I will get canceled. No, no, no. I will I, get canceled. I need to know why you like river I'm, otters. No, no, I'm not, I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. I'm going back to looking up the difference between a muscat. <laughs> a, a muskrat and What are you going to say? I'm not going to. No, what do you think you're going to say? You're, you're almost, you're, you're like, oh, you're not, not, you're not, hold on. you not saying something is like worse. His cousin yeah. was an otter. All I ask you. not saying something is way worse. All I ask you. Mark brings in, all otters matter. I'm like, shit, he's got a point. That's him just making a little joke. I said, why do you like river otters? That should be. like as as. As a very, very big racist, I should probably not talk right now. And Wait, it's like, what? You have friends that are otters, no one, right? <laughs> no one was accusing just, you of anything, I just think River. I did a project on river otters in second grade, and I think they're cuter. That's all. <laughs> That's all you had to say. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's all you had to say. And Donald Trump. You made it way worse. Otter. All right, what's a muskrat? Uh, I, I got distracted. Hold on, sorry. With what? <laughs> with, with the whole, you know. Do now all, you're getting distracted again. Yeah. Get back. What to am it. I? Uh, muskrats and otters. Yeah, mus difference. What's muskrat. The one, what's the one where they dig the big colony of holes and they all just pop their head out? That's prairie dog. Prairie dog. Prairie dog. Those, Those are good animals too. Those are good animals. Another uh, meerkat. Ooh. Good animal. Meerkat manor. Good show. Not meerkat is not a prairie dog. Can we see? Or it is. Can we see some it's meerkats? The same thing. They're cousins. The oh, <laughs> which one's the first cousin that uh, <laughs> had to be put? Uh, are we doing meerkats see, now? You guys just see all the lights in the room just flash. I did see that. One second. That was. I did see that. I I thought I was having a stroke. Max is trying to upload uh, part of my take. I think <laughs> just push the. If moment. you're waiting for part of my take, welcome to Mostly Sports. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> look, look at that. Look at them. And what is? Uh, uh, I, I got a take. Okay, Four-legged go animals that stand up are always funny. Always funny. Yeah. Always it, funny. Yeah. What uh? What was Timon in in Lion? He was a meerkat, right? He's a meerkat. I think he's, yeah. He's a meerkat. Yep. Yeah. And Pumbaa was a warthog. What was Daxter from Jack and Daxter? Ooh. Who's Jack? Oh, oh, that yeah, video know. game? What is Crash Bandicoot? What's Ratchet? Uh, like? Crash Bandicoot is a wildebeest. I think he's a bandicoot. He's a bandicoot. It's in his name. Oh, um. Is a bandicoot a real thing? Yeah, I think. I don't know if it's a real thing. Is it not? A it is a real thing. A bandicoot's a real thing. What? What's the difference in muskrats and otters? Um, muskrats are a little bit fatter. They also have a rat-like tail yeah. as opposed to like a paddle as a tail. Okay. And it says they're active typically around dawn and dusk. Well, what do they look like? It was dusk. What, what do they look like swimming in water? I, I can't describe. I could try and describe it to you. but Do kangaroos have opposable thumbs? I don't kangaroos think are the best animal. Because I think, I think that's a new animal we need. Kangaroos with opposable thumbs. Kangaroos, primate kangaroos. I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, uh, we don't need to They're going to learn how to use guns and weapons. Yeah, that's true. They can run 30 miles an hour. They can jump 10 feet in the air. Also, Basically, you have three legs because of the tail. They have, like, razor-sharp talent. We don't need Okay, it. TJ, fuck kangaroos. All right, the sorry. Most powerful I'm sorry. Animal. Also, I'm giraffes, sorry. giraffes are the best animal. Giraffes are the best animal. They're the best a animal. kangaroo what? would fuck up a giraffe. No, it wouldn't. Yes. Oh, a kangaroo A, a giraffe would kick giraffe the fuck out of a, a kangaroo. A giraffe wouldn't even know that the kangaroo oh, was there. And you got to be already. fucking... A giraffe would kick the shit out of a kangaroo. A kangaroo would stab uh, a giraffe and it's like underbelly well, with its talents. Yeah. And rip it, it couldn't it. reach it. It would disembowel it, it would disembowel. even got hurt. Yeah. 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 <laughs> they could jump 10 feet in the air. That's what kangaroos do, disembowel. Kangaroos are the best land animal. Octopuses are the best sea animal because they're from outer space. Hmm. How did we get on this? Uh, can me and Mark just talk yeah, for a yeah, second? Yeah, not a, not yeah. a big deal. Let's, uh, we should we should open the show. Yeah, with this. we should because I I know exactly where you're going and, uh, so, and I would like to go there as well. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Friday afternoon after oh. the show, <laughs> Connor Griffin. <laughs> Connor Griffin brought his mom to the office. <laughs> mm. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Just uh, did you or did you not? Bring your mom to the office. I brought her. Yeah, she was in town, and I brought her briefly <laughs> to check out the office. Stop! Let like, come on. Was <laughs> 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 it the ice? <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> 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 no, 
no, no, no. Lovely woman. Lovely woman. Thank you. We didn't say anything. We're just making, we haven't we're, said anything. We haven't said a word. We, said we literally haven't said a word. Woo! Woo! We have technically not said a word. Haven't said a word, dude. I haven't said a word. We've just... <laughs> Love, lovely woman. She was, yeah. Couldn't have been nicer. Yeah. She, she enjoyed meeting you guys. She thought you were very nice. Boy, did we enjoy meeting her too. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, uh, this is, I mean, Ebo? this is outrageous. Ebo, did you see? <laughs> stop, 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 stop Ebo, it. did you see Connor's mom? Yeah, you did, huh? <laughs> TJ, TJ, did you see Connor's mom? <laughs> oh, no. Tell it to Malasek, dude. Malasek was talking to her for like 10 minutes. Hey. It was, it was, it was bad. It was bad. <laughs> Just, I, again, have we said a word? Have we said a word, uh, an offensive word? I, was, I, we, we haven't really said anything. Uh, I will say this. The second you guys, Brandon and I were sitting in these chairs, and you brought your mom to the studio, we met her lovely lady. Um, couldn't have been lovely. Couldn't have, when I think of lovely ladies, I'm <laughs> yeah. thinking of her. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I hope she's not watching. I mean, she's not watching right now, but I, I hope she doesn't watch in general. I, uh, we haven't said anything. We're we're calling her a lovely it. lady? We called her a, uh, literally all we've said is she's a lovely lady. We've made it. Granted, we have made some noises, but. <laughs> not not to quote we always, always make sunny. Those noises. Uh, there's an implication here. Uh, uh, the second the second you guys walked out of the studio, Brandon, I just, <laughs> <laughs> we just immediately turned our show. Mark also like sprinted to find me in the office. He was like, did you did you see what what just did, did, did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> like, this is TJ was the first person that she met actually. Yeah. T- and TJ, <laughs> how come you didn't text us, dude? <laughs> TJ was very nice. Every listen, everybody was very hey, nice, and she hey. enjoyed coming into the office. Let me just say, I this. was not expecting this today, though. <laughs> Three days after the fact. Well, we didn't have a show. If we try, Connor, if we'd have had a show the next day, oh my god, oh my god. At least we had three days to calm down. <laughs> Oh, uh, what were we? <laughs> Lovely lady. Lo- uh, lo- just couldn't have been sweeter. Couldn't have been sweeter. Very nice. Lovely. Uh, very kind. Um, and my understanding, she does watch this show. So, uh, she- also, hold on real quick. Not a big deal. <laughs> what does your dad do for a living? My dad's a teacher. He's a teacher. Professor. teacher. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Good for him. Well, my parents are separated. Good. They're divorced. They're not together. Oh, bad for him. <laughs> but- that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> just, uh- that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Top break, buddy. <laughs> Wait, does that, does that? I'm not getting into any more of my, my personal life. I'm just saying. That, no, no, there's one more question that needs to be asked. Does that mean she's... She's, she's not... No, she's, she's not, not single. single? She's not. What, what the fuck's your brain? I, that, that's <laughs> all I'm saying. We're not getting into any... Can we talk about the Eagles? Can we, can we, can we talk about the game? Dude, we can talk about the Eagles. It's not that big of a deal. I thought, yeah, I, I thought we were going to get into that when you first turned to me Is on the couch and said we're talking about my mother. I will say, I will say Brandon asked you to, to not really... Talk. Brandon asked you to, if you didn't want to talk this episode. You said no, you would love to. So, I mean, he, he, did, he yeah, did offer you the you chance the to... Okay, let's talk about the Eagles. First question... Is your mom? I swear to you, I knew you were doing that. <laughs> I knew what? you were doing what? that. I just wasn't asking. Does she? Does she need tickets or what? What? what I... No, she's fine. Uh, no kidding. The whole place is spinning, and it was a very bad idea. I tell you what, I I met last night. I met this guy's dad. His parents were there. His dad came up. No, we talked about twenty minutes. And after meeting your dad last night, I went home and thank God that my dad was dead. Because of the drugs. My dad did a lot of drugs. And if he'd ever met your dad, he would have done a lot more. I'm just going to let you sit in that one. To kill himself. I'm just going to let you sit in that one. He would have done so many drugs. You're such a pussy. You know that? How am I a pussy? You talk so much shit about my father behind his back. No, I don't. When he when he st- when he walks, well, he's in, a thick chested man. Yeah. He's a barrel chested man. Fucking you, fucking crumble into All a right, puddle. I gave birth to your wormy. My ass. dad, he's a big. So, here's a, a story, thick boy. Piece. My dad walks up to Brandon, and uh, he t- he. So I saw my dad before, like as soon as he got to the event, um, and he's like he's like I think I want to mess with Brandon. Should I? And I was like, absolutely. Yeah. Um. So he walks up to Brandon. Brandon doesn't know what my what my father looks like. So my dad just walks up and goes, "Hey, Brandon, just want to say I'm a big fan." And then pauses. And Brandon goes, "Thank you." And he goes, "Of, of Titus, you suck." <laughs> 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 but I but I do love the show. Yeah, yeah it's good. It's really yeah, good. Yeah. And that that put Brandon in a tizzy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, he got me good. He got me. I should have known though. I told him after this, but like. He's a I don't know 55, 60 year old man, right? And he comes up and he says, "I'm a big fan." I should have known like. 
our fans are 24, 25, 26, and yeah. and absolutely just whatever. Um, Sounds like you hate your fans. Yeah, I was no, I love absolutely my, whatever. For the record, I, I love 24, 25. I, yeah, all I said was that's how old they are, different age that, from him. You said are whatever. What I is said, whatever? I said different age from him. Define whatever. I'm Completely if, different from him. Define whatever. You said 25, 26. If and, you could define are, whatever, it wouldn't be whatever. Whatever said, is whatever. You, you you can't define Do not whatever. yada yada our fan base. No, you can't do define not, whatever. Right now, there's a 29 year old kid watching on YouTube, furious at you. Yeah, like what am uh, I? Hey, a 29 year old's not a kid, and you know that. Apologize it's a kid. to him. Anyone younger than me is a kid. <laughs> <laughs> Apologize to him. To who? The, to the, whatever. The 29 year. Yeah. To whoever. The, to the whatever. All right, whoever. I apologize for whatever. Okay, that's and fair. That, that's a good. That's, and if you want to clip that that's from the heart, we can use that forever. <laughs> that's from the heart. Uh, your dad sounds like a funny guy. Yeah, yeah. He he can, yeah. He can cut it up. Every so often, um, yeah, but uh, he got under your skin, huh? Yeah, he did. I noticed your your mom wasn't as forward as introducing herself. Is she not? Is she not a fan of the show? Does she no, she like she's it? too much of a fan of the show, and she uh, she was aware of the uh, milf talk that infiltrated oh, the show, dude. and uh, she was trying to avoid that. Your dad uh, when she when <laughs> when your dad introduced when your dad introduced her, he said, "This is my wife." She's no Connor Griffin's mom. <laughs> yeah, but she's okay. He did the same thing to me. He's like, "Yeah, it's not your mom, but she she's all right." <laughs> I'd like to say hi to Mark's mom. Oh, hello, Mark's mom. I'm you, know Mark's mom. you know who you should say hi to. Who's that? Connor Griffin. <laughs> hi, Connor Griffin. <laughs> we can't Is she watch it right now? Okay, I'm sorry. We can't do this. Brandon. No, I'm just Brandon, we promised Connor. Uh, you're right. You're right. You're right. It's it's just good to say hi to your entire demographic of listeners, not just the 20, yeah. right. 25. Correct. Or whatever. Or whatever. I, I, I made the mistake of bringing my mom into the office the other day when she was visiting. It wasn't town. a mistake. Oh, yeah? You bring around Hank? No. Hank likes the older ladies. It's true. Hank likes them all. Hank likes Hank them all. Hank likes them if all. I know anything about Hank, he likes them all. Big, tall, yeah. but short, <laughs> yeah. skinny. Oh, he loves a big gal. He does. <laughs> Hank Hank likes a little ham hock, you know? <laughs> Hank likes a nice butt crack he can get lost yeah. in. He goes like spelunking. He puts on his miner's hat. He attaches a rope around the belay. <laughs> I'm not back in two there. hours. That's why he's always out of the office. He's not golfing. He's in a different bunker. You know? <laughs> <laughs> That would be a good rumor to start, just like yeah. Hank only goes for big ones. <laughs> only goes, yeah. Yeah. They need love, Those too. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right. What else? What? <laughs> <laughs> You've got, you brought your 10 takes? We, we're we're going to make a few layups. We are going to then cut out all the bad takes, which I know there are a lot of them coming. Um, and then we're going to just try to put out like a mixtape of Connor's takes mm -hmm. that are only the good takes to try to convince everybody that Connor – is actually good. Are we going to react positively to some of them for the mixtape? I think I think we as a show. Oh, this dude's spitting. I think that's the point of this is that we, you and I, have to. We kind of have to. We need him to get a win, so we do have to be. Supportive. We need him on the team. Okay, family. Uh, yeah. Okay, so family. Want my second thing to introduce this. If you guys, if you fans have do watch Family Guy, I watch Family Guy a lot. If you watch it, you know sometimes that Peter will be like, "All right, folks, it's a Meg episode." <laughs> Here's the remote. Don't blame me if you change it. This next 15 minutes is our Meg episode. <laughs> so I, I have some stuff in here that shut up, Meg. Is meant to to spark some conversation. All right, take number one. Take number two. Uh, football take. You don't have to. Wait, hold on. Why are you flipping pages? Correct. Like how, how how many no? How much? How big are your? Show notes? me the first page. I expected ten bullet points. Go back to the got, first page and show it to us. Yeah. Hold on a second. Why are you flipping pages like crazy? How 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 extensive are these notes? You, Can I be honest? The pages are totally blank. I've been going off. <laughs> I've been going off a of memorization this entire time. I think this guy I, is. I, I I think that's the coolest thing he's ever done. <laughs> I mean, that's the coolest thing he's ever the done. Pages are totally blank. You brought in a perfectly blank notebook. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> when you have a laptop in your lap, <laughs> what? Because I thought the visual of me flipping through the notebook would be fun. Did you go buy the notebook? No, I had this already. Where did we find this guy? <laughs> Where did we find this guy? Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> All right. He brought in a blank. <laughs> I told Ebo before the show. I said, "By the way, my my, my notebook is blank. Don't say anything." No, he's, no, no. Next time we have something important to say, if we got some takes, we need the notebook and like. <laughs> I just noticed he's flipping over. I'm like, how? Why did you flip it then? Because I was trying to Real do it. I, was, I wanted this moment. But then I noticed I it. I was like, how many? 
how many notes does he have on these fucking things? He's got to flip over. Every and I was, page. Uh, yeah. Like, trust me, I knew what I was. Also, doing. you said from memory, is it is it just on your screen on the laptop right now? It's on my screen in case I forget. But I do, I do have the tape. <laughs> oh, you're not doing it from memory. It's on your screen. I'm not looking at the screen. It's an open note test, Brandon. Yeah. Uh, oh I'm looking God. at you guys as I deliver the. But you, you could, you can read them. Like it wasn't. Ebo, do you, you ever sit here and ask think. you to memorize your takes? Wow, I share a couch with this guy. <laughs> yeah, I, I, it's impressive. That was a good, good little bit. All That's right, take so number five. <laughs> that is so funny. Take number five. <laughs> All right. Take number five. Let me find it. Um, I don't know. Orange keeps just, a list of, of great wrestling names, uh, and I got to give that to him. Two words, Juris. How do I say, prudence. how do I spell Juris and Prudence? J-U-R-U-S. You just made that up. Uh, and then last name, P-R-U. What if it was with a Y, though? Like Juris Prudence. <laughs> a J with, like, the dots over it. I mean, sure. you with the dots with over it. Yeah. How do we spell imprudence? Uh, P R U. D- oh, well, yeah. What if he was really prude too? Like he was like, uh, yeah, prude dance. Not going to Vegas. There's prude dance, and he's like, he loves the law, but he also like he he makes time for himself to dance a little bit every <laughs> so every so often. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's the uh, it's a footloose spinoff that dancing is illegal. But Juris Prudence is here to <laughs> <laughs> to change the laws of the town to make dancing <laughs> allowed. Uh, <laughs> Are you texting somebody? Yeah, I'm, I'm sending. I'm texting Orange Cassidy that Juris Prudence name because I like it. Okay. All right, all right. If this pops off, yeah, you it's yours. I I deserve something. It's, I don't know what I that just, is. I'm going to. Yeah. Why all can't right. you just wrestle as Juris Prudence? I'll wrestle as Juris Prudence. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Mark Titus is a decent wrestling name. Yeah, it is. Mark the Shark Titus. All right. Shark Boy. Uh, All right. So well, f- fuck it. I'll go wrestle. I'll tell him that name. Mark Titus. Fuck it. You know what? I'll go wrestle. I got a wrestling thing. Yep. Little show and tell. Okay. Oh. Well, we're showing and telling now. What What are we telling? I was uh, sent a package. Okay. The total package. Only Brandon will know what this is. All right. Oh my goodness! How did you get that? Whoa, that's awesome! And I don't even know what it is. All wrestlers who go to Japan, that steakhouse gives them a Rivera sta- uh, jacket, and it's uh, a point of pride in the wrestling community to have one. Why do you have one? Whoa! Because I'm big in the wrestling community. That's not. I I had a podcast that got canceled after like they let me go for like a year and a half. And you got a jacket? No. Damn. That's pretty awesome. Uh, you, are you gonna? Thanks. Uh, are you gonna hang that in the studio? Are you gonna wear that? How? What's the? It's a piece of. of it's a prestigious piece of merchandise. So probably hanging in the studio in the wrestling corner over here. Mm. But the, you don't get the wrestling corner. Do you have a jacket? <laughs> yeah, you don't have anything wrestling in your corner. I do sure you? don't. I just realized that now. I need some wrestling stuff. Did you have? Uh, I'll, I'll bring in my wrestling buddies. I'm sure my parents. You still have wrestling Ooh. buddies? Do they keep those? everything. My parents. They do. Yeah, my parents are hoarders. My dad Damn. sold all my stuff for drugs a long time ago. By the way, uh, wrestling character hoarders. Uh, it's <laughs> Is he an appetizer? <laughs> it's a no. It's a prostitute who uh, <laughs> last <order>. name Durs. <laughs> uh, <and laughs> they just keep everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what, write that one down. What about what about whore d'oeuvres? Whore d'oeuvres. She's a waitress, a slutty waitress that serves appetizers yeah, the whole time. Yeah, she's got a cocktail plate, <laughs> but she's after cock and tail. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's a disguise, right? You think she's? That's what she's going for the whole time. You think she's a cocktail waitress, but really she's a cock and the tail waitress. <laughs> whore d'oeuvres. <laughs> oh, whore d'oeuvres would be good. <laughs> you know what I got to go do? I gotta go to O'Hare and pick up my mother-in-law who's coming in for Thanksgiving. Are you are you a stand-up comic? Because we were talking about this on the Yak, where you're doing like that's an actual sentence I said out of my face. I know, but that's like, folks, let me tell <laughs> folks. You know what I hate. You know, <laughs> you know what I gotta do this weekend. Anybody married? Anybody in the room married? Uh, boy, mother-in-law, mother-in-law, am I right? Yeah. No, I gotta leave in just a minute. I gotta go pick up my my mother-in-law. You guys ever get on the ninety here in uh here in Chicago? Boy, the construction on the ninety is uh. I ninety is is, uh, is something. Anybody from Chicago in the room? Huh? You gotta pick I, up my mother in law. Yeah, I got I gotta go. It's the other day I had to pick up my mother in law. But I ha- you haven't allowed me to tell you the horror story about it. I don't think you can call your mother in law that. They <laughs> <laughs> are relax. <laughs> relax. I okay. This is what I have to do. Yesterday, my wife calls me and says <laughs> 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 Stop. 
So I'm sitting there yesterday, right? I don't know where my my wife calls, and she says, "Hey, tomorrow, <laughs> you gotta you gotta go pick up my mom." I said, "Your mom?" So I gotta go to O'Hare Airport and pick up my mother-in-law? Come on, guys, what are we talking about? Anyway, she goes on to say, "Yeah, so my mom my mom <laughs> my mom's coming in, and her phone broke, so she doesn't have a phone." I said, well, "Why don't she why doesn't she go get a why doesn't she go get a phone?" And she says she doesn't have time. So I got to wake up this morning, and I got to go to O'Hare, pick up my mother-in-law, who doesn't have a phone. How hard is that going to be? Anyway, I'm Brandon Walker. <laughs> and I'm literally crying. I'm literally, I'm literally crying. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is actual moisture <laughs> in my eyeballs. <laughs> you, you should end it with, pick up my mother-in-law, and boy, are my arms tired. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, oh, my God. Do we end the show there? Yeah. End it. I think that's it. Oh, my God. Uh, subscribe. Like the stream. 